We decided to take a road trip to Windsor, Missouri to visit the Amish communities and to shop at their stores. I saw many uh, sights and sounds as we traveled, which I'm sharing with you right now. My wife did all of the driving, which I very much appreciated. We went by White Men Air Force Base and saw many troop movements. Along the way, I saw interesting places with white picket fences, a lot of countryside uh, fields and farms, as well as forests as we travel. So I hope you enjoy some of this and I will come in and comment on some things a little later. I love taking pictures of barns and farms, so you'll see a number of those in this video. We saw a lot of cattle grazing as we traveled. There seems to be a lot of cattle in Missouri. Our first stop was at Lilac Lang Bulk Foods. Uh, we arrived there before we actually arrived in Windsor. Windsor was not too far away. I took a number of pictures of little features that I thought you might enjoy, kind of showed the personal touch of the store owners. When you come into the front entrance of the store, you're greeted with wonderful scents and smells of uh, various soap. My wife was in seventh heaven. She'd been planning to go to Windsor for a long time and she just enjoyed going through the shop, seeing all the different bulk foods, a lot of it homemade, some of it brand. We kind of concentrated more on the homemade foods or the foods produced by them. As you can see, flowers and sugar, and uh, like I said, a lot of bulk foods for um, baking and canning. A lot of canned goods here, by the way. There were a lot of candies on the shelf, uh, just a place that children would love to come and buy and eat. Lilac Lane Bulk Food is a very pleasant place. It's welcoming good lighting, has a restroom, I think you will enjoy coming out here. Right next to Lilac Lane is the county auction place. A number of people gathered there in the morning. They auction on Tuesdays and Fridays. We went through the town of Windsor to go to our next bulk food store. A very pleasant place. It reeks of God, country, and family, which is very, very American. Which way? Caught a number of pictures, saw this young Amish boy going into a store to shop. Took this uh, photo to remind me that the cell phone coverage was spotty and our map app didn't work and so we had to go in people's driveways and turn around until we had cell phone coverage to figure out where we were. We stopped in a parking lot to figure out where we were and saw this bear statue, so I took a photo of it. Hope you enjoy it. My wife said they have a hospital and a senior center. 
also an adult daycare center for you. Thanks, is what I said. Thanks. Yeah. Coming through the town of Windsor, <laughs> right by the United States Post Office. I'm hoping Reno will come back here and I can get a picture of the Katie State Park. We pass through the town again to go to our next destination, and we'll come back to Windsor to visit their park, Farrington Park. One thing you notice when you come in here, there is no electricity whatsoever, no refrigeration. Everything is lit by natural lighting. So on a dark day, it might be hard to see. You might want to bring your headlight or a flashlight. Uh, one thing we did notice here that there was a canning jar rings, which was about 22 cents a piece. Here's Rainy reminding me what's going to happen if I don't uh, comply. that the prices were a little higher on some items here than at Lilac Lane Global Store. We're now heading back to Windsor to go visit the park.
We arrived at Farrington Park to eat lunch and do some fishing. We walked around the lake. I took a lot of photos and I will do a special video on this park. A pleasant place. Really, really enjoy it. Well, we headed back to uh, home and took a number of pictures of the countryside as we left. Really enjoyed it. Uh, I encourage you to come out to visit Windsor, Missouri.